Thank you for chairperson. Today I will talk about uh, I'm Kosuke Wakasugi from Konar University in Japan. Today I will talk about analysis of the effect between the information type on SNS and the user attribute during disaster. When disaster have occurred, many pe many people have posted the various information uh, about the disaster on SNS, such as X. In among such information, there is information that encourages people to facilitate behavior. For example, the river has flooded, so please do not approach or please evacuate to a shelter. We call such information behavior facilitation information hereafter BF information. We found that BF information has various types and we believe that the presentation of BF information is crucial for disaster prevention and mitigation. So, however, we are not sure what kind of BF information uh, is appropriate for the users. And in addition, there are cases where BF information has the opposite effect on user. Please look at the picture. In this case, positive person read this information and think I have to evacuate. On the other hand, a crucial person read this information and think let's go to see. So the uh, they take opposite action being asked for. As a result, the call to action causes more dangerous. And in addition, there are different type of user browsing SNS, and their attributes such as uh, personality trait, age, and gender are different. So. It is, it is important to provide appropriate information according to each person's attribute. So, yeah, the purpose of this research is that we analyze what type of PDF information is appropriate for each user's attribute. This is the flow of our research. First, I will talk about method, method of how to extract BF information. When we extract BF information from X, we use Roberta Japanese pre-trained model, one of deep learning model to create a BF extracting model. Uh, as a fine tuning, we use 80% of training data and the remaining 20% as test data for five cross validation. Please look at the tables. First, uh, the number of BF information and non BF information is like this, and the parameter of BF information is like this. And the result of performance at our model is like this. From this result, our uh, extracting model is benefit for extracting BF information. Next, I will talk about how to classify the behavior axis. So, I will, first, I will talk about the definition of behavior axis. Uh, we propose four types of BF information based on our previous experiment. The suggest label urge users to take action, and uh, the inhabitation label uh, suppress, restrain, or prohibit, prohibit users from taking action, and uh, the encouragement label encourage and empower users. Finally, the wish label is request to user. Uh, examples are like this, and. Uh, we, uh, we refer to those four types as uh, behavior axis. So, we use Roberta model to create behavior axis classification model. And please look at the table. This table, uh, this table shows the result of our behavior axis classification model. As a result, 
uh, from a result, uh, our V uh, our classification model is benefit for for ex, uh, to classifying B favorable axis. And next, I will talk about the classification of users attributes. So we focus on Big Five personality trait as the user attribute. And Big Five is one of the popular theory of the personal characters, which made up for of extraversion, agreeableness, conscientiousness, and the neutralities open to experience. And please look at the table. This, uh, this table shows each Big Five personality trait and its explanation. But we use 10 item personality inventory to measure users' big five personality trait. And this measure is each big five personality trait on this scale take a value from 1 to 14. Next, we conduct an experiment. So, in purpose of our experiment, we evaluate the degree of information that users feel is appropriate for each user attribute based on the classification of the proposed behavior axis, suggest level, inhabitation level, encouragement level, and wish level. And we use six categories considering gender and age like this. And the number of all experimental data is like this. <clears throat> and next, I will talk about method of evaluating user reaction for each behavior axis. First, we ask, ask the subject to look at the information presented to them and <clears throat> answer each question as if they are typhoon victims. Here is a question for each of the behavior axis, and we use four point Ricardo scale at which is a method to measure the extent to which people agree with the, the content of the question. And we present <coughs> present subjects with a total of two hundred pieces of information. And we analyze uh, two, uh, two, uh, 248 people for whom we have varied responses. And we categorize each group of users with each personality trait using the six categories that take into account age and gender mentioned area. Uh, this table shows the number of uh, subjects to each, each group. <laughs> Finally, we analyze the result of experiments. We judge the questionnaire on a scale of 1 to 4. The 3 and 4 are considered to act appropriately for the behavior axis, and their score are set to 1, and the other points are set to 0. We do this for each user category and calculate the, the, the average. So <clears throat> we assume that I, items whose mean exceeds 0 0.5 are appropriate information for the user of the category. So we use three viewpoints to analyze the result of average score reaction for each six category and the pre personality trait. First, we discuss at the viewpoint of the behavior axis. First, I will talk about the result of suggest label. From this result, uh, suggest label is not appropriate information for most users. And because of this, uh, there is a lot of suggest label information that does not indicate a specific action such as be careful of. And we consider that user cannot understand what action to take and do not think to take action. At inhabitation level is uh, not is appropriate information for about half of users. 
and we consider that the users feel certain when they read such information, for example, don't do it, and feel that <coughs> they should inhabit the behavior. Next, I will talk about the result of encouragement level. From the result, all personality traits of all the users who have M3 and F F3 is not appropriate to, to present uh, encouragement level. So we consider that the older age users feel that information such as good luck is too intrusive or bothersome based on their personal life experiences. Finally, I will talk about the result of wish level. From this result, which level is not appropriate information for about most users, but is appropriate information for both male and female users in the younger gener generation. We consider that many of the requests, such as please spread this tragic information, are requested by victims, and many young users saw this information and wanted to spread it on SNS or a volunteer at the site. <clears throat> Next, we discuss viewpoint of personality trait. This is a result of uh, viewpoint of uh, uh, personality trait. So we consider the number of appropriate information over 0 0.5 for each personality trait. And from this result, there is evidence that the, inf uh, the BF information itself has no effect on user with conscientiousness and neutralism regardless of personal uh, behavior axis. Next, we discuss viewpoint of age and gender, and we pick up M3 and F3 result. From re a result of M3 and F3 older generation group, BF information is not appropriate information for older generation users, excluding inhabitation level. So we consider that older generation are users are not familiar with information on SNS. So, Contribution of our research as a follow. In viewpoint of behavior, access, age, and gender, uh, suggest label is not appropriate information regardless of user attribute. And inhibition label is appropriate information at regardless of user attribute. And uh, encouragement label and wish label are appropriate information for younger generation, but not for older generation. Uh, finally, in the viewpoint of personality trait, BF information is appropriate for user with ex, uh, is not appropriate for user with conscientiousness and neutralism. Uh, conclusion, uh, conclusion, and future work are like this. Thank you. <laughs>